I'm going to explain to you exactly why technology is destroying small and big channels. So what happens is you make a video that you're very happy with, you put a lot of thought into the thumbnail and the title, your keywords, etc. And you post the videos. So what's the biggest mistake we all do? We get excited and we send the link to our friends, our family, we post it on social media. So now you're all excited, you're starting to get a couple of extra views from your friends and some people on social media. Great, perfect. Nope. Big mistake, and this is the reason why. YouTube runs on an algorithm which is both simple and complicated. And the reason for this is that now, if you go and post a link to your video, YouTube's not gonna be able to figure out who to push your content out to. It's not gonna be able to build that organic audience. So it's just gonna see people coming through, you're gonna lose out on that click-through impression. And the reason for that is they're clicking through a link. They're not going and clicking on an actual video for that through your channel. One of the remedies to do this is if you must insist on sending out um, new videos is rather put a post on social media or if you're speaking to your friends on WhatsApp or wherever it may be and say, hey guys, I've got a new video, send the link to your channel. Let them go into your channel and let them click on that video which will help increase your impression rate. Otherwise, it's going to mix up the algorithm, your video is going to tank and it's really not going to do well and all that hard effort you've put into your great video that you knew is going to do well it's just gonna tank and it's just gonna demotivate you and you're gonna feel like making less and less videos and it's a very common problem with small creators. Even sometimes with big creators when you know you kind of flatline with your videos and your views are just kind of staying the same, um, it's a big problem. The second remedy to this if you must insist on sending a direct link is to wait at least 48 to 72 hours before you do post that link or send it to somebody else. That will give YouTube enough time to figure out who to push this out to, who's the correct audience. The very, very last thing that you want is for YouTube to push this out to the wrong people and it's great, they're clicking on your video but they're closing it before 30 seconds is over and that's going to signal, send signals to the algorithm in a very, very negative way. So this is one of the ways that I would encourage for you guys to try. I'd love to hear from you all, so if you have tried this method already and it worked for you, please comment down below. If you are going to try this method, let us know what the results are. We're quite interested to know. And uh, if there's anything we can do to help you and your channel, we're always here to help. We will answer all of our comments. And uh, please don't forget to give us a thumbs up and subscribe. It really does help us uh, gain traction on our channel. And again, like I always say, be kind to others. You never know what they've been through.